All right, thank you. Good morning. And I'm enjoying this fresh air of my fellow creation, nature. You see it all behind me? Nature, good energy, good information, good love, good peace. Whatever you could ask for within yourself, you could find it within nature, within God's creation. You know what? I had a... Okay, yesterday I posted a video. And it was of myself and my loved ones, uh, you know, having a conversation, which we always do. You know, serious conversations about life. Not about gossiping and about my neighbor or you know just just tr stuff that's gonna enhance yourself or others you know conversations that build and not tear down but um the conversation i posted yesterday of me and my family or my family and myself was about the ozone layer my son had the floor and he's telling me all about the ozone layer about what they have to trap or whatever but you know what? That stuff pondered me all night. It kind of meditated in my spirit all night about the ozone layer. And it's like something like my melanin kicked in. I am the ozone layer. Okay, if I'm the ozone layer, okay, for one, the ozone layer is like a, an umbrella, umbrella over the earth blocking the sun UV rays so they don't directly come to earth hit earth and harm the plants and the people and destroy earth but it's like my my instinct kicked in you know the information from the universe from my father kicked in saying you are the ozone layer for earth for this planet earth you are they are destroying the ozone layer by all of the toxins the different chemicals and things going into the ozone layer getting stuck there and if you look at it black people my people the relationship that we have with the sun and by the creator putting us here on this earth as a shield, a protector of all the other human beings. And we're not realizing our role or our place for being here on this earth. We are their ozone layer and they are destroying us. All of the toxins, the different stuff we partake in our bodies. And we I can't blame them because once we step into the knowledge of knowing who we are, why we're created the way we're created, things will change. It do, it's not going to take marches. It's not going to take hand-to-hand -hand combat. It's not going to take guns. It's not going to take their round-the-table meeting. No, it's going to take our round-the-table meeting and our changing our ways for this whole cycle of this earth, this world we're in, to change. It's about us changing us. Don't look at anything that they're doing to cause you or your community or your race of people being the way it is. Look at when we do whatever it takes to change ourselves, change our community, change our state world it starts with us it starts with myself I want to be the best I can be I want to find out why I am the way I am how why you created what's the purpose when we find that out everything we're looking for to change in this dog on earth that they're not going to give to you you're going to get it by the way he said the last shall be first and the first shall be last. And the way that's going to happen is we're going to return back to the original plan. So remember, we are the ozone layer. Yes, they are destroying us. But it's going to take us learning 
what to do about to get this whole thing to change for us to rise as a people okay well I guess walking in this nature gives me that little inspiration to share it with you all but again enjoy nature enjoy your trees because we are one